What's up everybody? It's Neil here with Galaxy S4 Softmodder. Today I'm going to show you how to quickly launch apps, make phone calls, compose messages, and a lot more with only your volume keys. Or if you want to call them your volume rockers. So um, I can only imagine that one day we won't even need these things on our devices just because that's just how it seems that things are going. I mean, some devices don't even have a hard home key anymore, like the Nexus line. I mean, even this has soft keys. So I can only imagine one day that we won't have these actual physical buttons to press. But till we do, it's awesome to give them new functionalities and really uh, give them a little bit of more purpose on a device. Typically, you would need to be rooted to um, have a super user permission to do something like this. But with this free application, and no root, you'll actually be able to do some pretty nifty things with your volume keys. And this will come in handy if you're wearing gloves, if it's cold, and also just because it's real quick and it's uh, one of the quickest alternatives I've found to launching apps and doing other actions that they give you um, without being rooted and having a, a mod installed. So um, it's free, it's on Google Play, and it's called Quick Click, and that's one word. So let's just open it up and show you how it works. I'm going to open it up. First thing I'm going to do is I'm going to go through the settings. Get that out of the way. Alright, so you can toggle it on. You can uh, preserve battery life by uh, only having the service run when the screen is on. Uh, you can dictate when the service listens for clicks. So you can do this always. So when you're just, and sorry, you can do this always. You can do this when the screen is off only, when the screen is on only, or when the screen is on but locked. So uh, always basically means you can do it at any time, obviously. Okay, and then uh, the restore volume option is a good one. Uh, after you perform the action, it'll, it'll revert the volume back to right before when you actually did the action. Because if you press volume up four times, then it's going to leave your volume up. But with this check, it'll put it back down four after you complete the action. Uh, you can add a widget, and you can uh, show a notification bar. Uh, I don't want it in my notifications, so I just toggle that off. All right, so let's go back. And you're just going to hit new action. Now, there's a couple of actions. There's flashlight, photo, video, uh, dictaphone, call, message. Sound is kind of a dumb one. You can basically apply a whip, buzzer, Star Wars sound, or something you have on file. Uh, that's not really useful to me unless you want to have a, a specific sound toggle when you do this action. Um, so there's sound, there's a configuration. You can uh, have it work with Tasker if you have that application. And then there's app at the bottom. Now some of these are pretty easy. You would just hit flashlight and that's it. Some of them will require a little bit more configuration like photo. Let's just show you real quick. F photo, you need to pick the camera if you want rear or front facing. Uh, quality, you can put high. Uh, flash, you can enable. Autofocus, you can enable. Um, also with message or call, you need, to, you need to specify who you want to call. So let's just go ahead and do, um, let's do call. Pretty straightforward. Now just pick a contact. And then here's where you're actually uh, put together the sequence of, of keys you're going to press. You can even do one action. It actually lets you do that. I don't know why you would want that, but you can. Or you can go all the way up to five. But for the sake of this, let's just do three. Let's just do plus three times. And I'm ready. Now I can change the name of this action. Call the Nelson. That's fine. Play a sound when the action is started. Let's just toggle that right now. Vibrate when action is started. Uh, let's all leave that on. So I'm going to finish. Um, Alright, so I actually have one that's already sequenced to up, up, up. So let's get rid of that. To uh, edit or adjust any of your existing actions, just tap on it. You bring up the options. Here you can change it, you can delete it, and you can just uh, make those minor changes to it. And uh, So let's just delete this one completely. So now up, up, up is just going to call Nelson. So that's basically it. Now I'm just going to hit up, up, up. It's going to call Nelson. There you go. Oops. All right, so uh, that's that. Let's just show you one more action. Let's do right to Nelson, which is down, down, down. 
There you go. You see my thing reverted back to where it was. Now it's just asking me where I want a message from. So it's um it's pretty cool. Uh, check out the full article. It's really detailed. Everything you need everything you need to know is there. You got a link to Google Play there. Um, also remember, you do not need root. It's super convenient, super quick, and yeah, take advantage of it. Like, comment, subscribe. Go to Galaxy S4 Softmodder for the article and enjoy, guys.